Good day, dear students. Welcome back sa to our um, YouTube channel, which is Math and Chill. Another day and another time to relax with math. So last time we discussed about simplifying radical expressions using the product rule. This time around, sa atong episode 4, episode, episode 4, so episode 4 na tayo, no? I-discuss na to ang pag-simplify, how to simplify, simplify, radical, expressions using the quotient rule so kung saan ginaingon sa quotient rule ang quotient rule Nag-ingon nga, kung nakay radical expression na uh, square root of a, I'm oh, sorry, kung nakay radical expression na the square root of a over b, Equal na siya sa square root of a over the square root of b. So, yun na lang siya kasimple, no? So, natin mga rule how to simplify. Number one. Right. The radical expression as the quotient of Radical expression. And number two, simplify the numerator and the denominator so muna siya ang kwan rule so let's have an example Let's say we have this example now. Example. Simplify the square root of 5 over 36. So that little okay now, no? Solution the square root of five over thirty six is equal to based sa quotient rule equal na siya sa the square root of five over the square root of thirty six. 
So, simplify na na siya. Square root of 5, dilim na siya ma. Uh, ma further simplify na ito na. Okay. Disimala na siya kung atong i-simplify further. So, ato na siyang leave as it is. The square root of 5. Over 36 is a perfect square. So, 36. This is equal to 6 times 6. 6 times 6. This is equal to 6 squared. 36. Therefore, that is 6 squared. Equivalent to 6 squared. So, simplify na ito, the square root of 5 over cancel ang square root. Mahabilin is 6. So, muna yung atong answer. Final answer. So, ano lang siya kasimple, no? Now, supposing we have another example particularly particularly a radical expressions na naga-involve siya o variables so for example na atay example Simplify the square root of, uh, let's say, 2, 3, 4, x, 11, y, all over the square root of, let's say, 26, x 7 and y so atong first example lahi siya no isa lang siya ka uh, radical kini isa lang radical there is a second example kita gaan taog uh, expression involving two separate uh radical expressions okay. separate siya separate na siya so sa so, itong buhato na na first so balik ta dyan no? so pag na nalagay siya nag involve na nga siya o variable ato na siyang i-simplify first by this is equal to i-combine sa nato sila no combine mahi muna na siyang Ah, 2, 3, 4 x, 11 y pareho na siya ibaligtad lang 26 x raised to 7 y so nga nung i-combine na ito sila para ato sa siyang pagamyon pagamyon sa nato na siya o una bago na ito siya i Simplify separately. So, padahin ta. So, simplify na ito na siya. ganito
kung i-simplify na ito na siya, equal na po na siya sa um, let's say the square root of 2, 3, 4 over 26 times square root of x11 or x7 times square root of y over y. Remember the product rule. So let's simplify further. So now, sa nato ni simplify ning uh, constant na. So, i-divide na to ang 2, 3, 4, 2, 26. Kung, ang sama na siya, divisible ba na siya sa 26? Ang 234, is is it divisible to 26? Or divisible by 26? So, mag-trial and error ta dire. So, example 234 234 divide 26 so mangita number na kung i natin 26 mo result siya sa 234 let's say 26 26 mo na to 8 8 times 26 ila na siya 26 20, 26 times 8 6 times 8 plus siya, 24 times 248 okay, 4 times 2 times 8 16 208 so delete siya. so i-increase na to o oh, 1 1 ibutan na to 9 9 times 26 is equal to plus 26 8 plus 6 14 carry 1 of 34 so 234 so ang result in niya is the square root of 9 234 so the square root of 9 so, siya. Simplify na nato ang constant. Ang sunod na itong nabuhatan is since multiplication, eh, multiply na ito na siya sa remaining na part sa expression. So, ang saan ganito siya pag-divide o guan uh, variable. Remember na mag multiply ganito o variables ang atong with the same uh, base for example x times x i-add na to ang exponent diba na na siya i-quandra ang x na na siya i-1 na exponent sumahin mo siyang x 1 plus 1 is equal to x squared na na siya x squared na siya multiplying uh, variables with the same base para sa ane, x raised to 1 times x raised to 1 is equal to x copy ang base x i-add ang exponent mo na siyang na x x x raised to 2 so since ang division is inverse na siya sa multiplication for example x divided by x Kung i-add na to sa multiplication ng sa division of variable, ato ang i-minus. 
copy the base which is x x 1 I minus na to ang exponent 1 so may tabuan na niya x raised to 0 any number or any variable raised to 0 is equal to 1 ano na siya so balik pa diri sa given na kuan expression ato na siyang i-divide ang since pareho ang iyang a base x kini siya x ug x so x raised to 11 x raised to 11 times or divide x raised to 7 may mo na siyang x raised to 11 minus 7 so x raised to 4 so may mo na siyang multiplied by x raised to 4 times y over y divide nato na siya may muna siyang may muna siyang oh, y divided by y is equal to y 1 minus 1 is equal to y equals is to 0 is equal to 1 so any number or any variable raised to 0 is equal to 1 so mo na siya ang y may mo na siya ang the square root of y over y may mo na siya ang one. So, padayin ta. Simplify. Square root of 9. Perfect square. This is 3. Times x raised to 4. Equal na na siya sa x squared times x squared. Multiplied by 1. So, simplify na to na siya further. 3 times square root of x squared times square root of x squared times 1. So, this is 3. Makancel ang square root. X times cancel, cancel. X times 1. Therefore, we should 3. X times X, X squared. Times 1 is equal to 3. X squared. Therefore, ito ang answer is 3x squared. So, that's it. So, muna siya ang pag-simplify sa radical expressions using the quotient rule. I hope na may natun ang today. And uh, thank you for spending your time. And kung wala pa mo naka-follow or wala pa mo naka-subscribe sa doon channel, i-click lang ang button down below para updated ka sa ito. Kung nana tayo bagong video, nana tayo bagong discussion nga i-upload na po. So student, padayin sa pag-study and always love math. So, dili lang dili I mean, dili ang, ang, ang math dili na siya stressful, no? Kung alam good, ito uh, lang na siyang i-treat as ka ng pastime chill chill lang. So, muna itong channel is math and chill So, that's all for today and good day